Welcome back to Digital Media Pocket Knife. I'm your host, Steve Brzezinski, and in today's episode, I'm going to teach you how to insert video into your open office impress presentation. What's cool about adding video to your presentation is that you're actually able to get your point across more clearly when you add visual elements like video. And with all the slideshow software out there, it's actually very easy to incorporate video into your presentation no matter what you're using Google Slides, Microsoft PowerPoint, or Open Office Impress. Now before we dive into this, I want to let you know that in the description below, I'm going to give you a link to a checklist. The checklist is going to be there for you to use so that anytime you want to add video to your presentation, you just follow the steps on the checklist, check it off as you go, you're going to have the best presentation in the group because you're adding video. Alright, now without further ado, let's dive into it. The first thing you want to do when you open your open office and press presentation is you want to select the slide that you want to put the video on. So right now I've got slide one selected. Um, I've only got two slides in this presentation. I want to put the video on a slide by itself immediately after slide one. So with slide one selected, I go to insert, click slide, and that automatically puts in a new slide. Um, I want to actually get rid of these text boxes and start with a blank slate. Uh, you can click the text and then click the blue box around the text and then click the delete key on your keyboard. So this slide is now blank, blank canvas. Um, what I can do now to insert the video is go up top to insert and then down to movie and sound. A dialog box is gonna open on your computer. And so now at this point you navigate to the spot on your computer where the video lives. So it might be in your desktop, in your documents, in your downloads, in your videos folder. Once you select the video that you wanna put into your presentation, click open. Now if you get an error in the dialog box that pops up and says, sorry, you can't put this video in, unfortunately, OpenOffice Impress doesn't allow a large list of different format videos to be used. So you'll have to either find a video or convert the video into a different format if you absolutely have to use the video that you were planning to use. Um, you may have noticed that the white canvas kind of disappeared. This video is a, a fairly large video. And um, if you haven't set up the, your slide template to be the same proportions as the video, then you're gonna have to make your video the same proportion as the slide template. Um, once you zoom out by hitting the minus key in the lower uh, right-hand corner of the application, you're gonna see that, yeah, this video is quite large. Any of the green nodes that you see on the outside of the video clip, uh, you can actually click that and you'll see that um, before you click, there's a double arrow that pops up. So you can click on any one of those green nodes and then drag the video to resize it to a, a size that's a little bit more comfortable. So you drag, hold, and you resize. Before you let go of the mouse, you may notice that the mouse doesn't, um, or, or resizing the video this way does not constrain their proportion. So if I were to drag too far to the left or too far up and down, then we're getting kind of this oval earth and we both know that earth is uh, round and uh, this isn't gonna fly. So one trick that we can do is on the keyboard, while we're holding down our mouse button on the, uh, the left side of the mouse, we hold also the shift key on the keyboard. Either one of the two shift keys, you got one on the left side, one on the right. And we can then drag this video or drag this clip um, and it does constrain the proportion so we always have a round earth. Keep that shift key that you held on on the keyboard and then release the mouse button on your um, on the mouse. And then boom, you see that the video kind of resized. So then we can drag this video onto the canvas. We have to eyeball where we want the center to be because it doesn't auto snap to the center. Um, and then in the lower right corner, we can zoom in back to a more comfortable size. And there you have it. That's how you insert video into open office. If you liked this video or found it helpful, please subscribe to my channel. I aim to give you guys tech and creative tips that you can use to build your skill set. Don't forget that I added a link in the description so that you can go and grab this checklist so that anytime you want to add video to your presentation, you have it right there at your fingertips. That's it for this video. I'm Steve Kwasinski. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you guys next time on Digital Media Pocket Knife.